The rules of this hide and seek are simple. The seeker will become a Jeff, and the hider has two minutes to hide anywhere on the entirety of this massive map. Because the map's so big, the Jeff will have three questions to ask the hider. Now I have a question for you goats. Why haven't you checked out our merch? Head to sunnyandmelon.com for awesome plushies. Melon, you know the rules, brother. You have two minutes to find a hiding spot, and then I'll become Jeff and eat you. Oh no! Guys, this is not good. I've got two minutes to hide. And because I'm a hider, I can't even pick up this crowbar to defend myself. But I will take this chocolate bar. Now, I need to find myself a hiding spot. Dang it, dang it, where can I hide? There's a Jeff in this house. I can't go in there. I'm a helpless melon. Which means, I've got to hide away from the Jeffs. And where's the only place that a Jeff doesn't spawn in? The forest. I think I know where I'm gonna hide. Just gotta make it up here. Oh, melon. I'm starting to transform. I'm a Jeff, and you only have one minute left to hide. That's fine! Goats, I've made it to the top of this mountain. Now, you won't suspect me to be up here, hopefully. Can I parkour up these trees? No, I can't. But I'm in the middle of this secluded forest. There's no chance Sonny finds me. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. And I'm hungry. Just look into my eyes. Oh, I'm cursed, bruh. You might be cursed, Sonny, but you have no idea where the melon is hiding. Yeah, well, why don't I start by asking one of my three questions. Are you hiding near a other players. No. Interesting. Because I see quite a few in the street here that I'm about to go eat while I think about where you're hiding. I want to munch. I want to munch. I want to munch. Melon, I'm about to eat them. Any last words, bacon hairs? Ow, Luffy's killing me. Well, that didn't go so good. Maybe I'll just stick to hide and seek. Yeah, you probably should, Sonny. But I'm gonna be honest, there ain't gonna be much seeking. Yeah? Well, I'm gonna ask my second question. If you're not hiding near other players for cover, are you hiding near the center of town or somewhere on the outskirts? Definitely on the outskirts. That means I gotta go up really high to get a better vantage point. Whereabouts is the melon hiding? He's on the edge of town somewhere. Ooh, let me ask this question. Are you hiding at a place of high or low elevation? I am hiding at a place of higher elevation. Excellent. So you might be in one of these watchtowers or somehow parkoured on top of a tree. Yes, I might be. This is so hard to find you. I don't know where you are. It's a big map, Sonny. Yeah, it is. And the outskirts are really big. There's there's way too much ground for me to cover. And the sun's already setting. Hopefully some other Jeffs kill you. Oh, uh, this is not good. All right, Sonny, you have until the sun sets. Bro, I just realized the world has no end. There's no wall over here. Nothing is high at this edge of town. The road just cuts off, but the map keeps going. I'm gonna be real, Sonny. I might be eaten by some Jeffs here. I'm on the outskirts at a taller elevation outside in the middle of the wilderness. Yeah, that's great and all. I hope my fellow Jeffs eat you. They can't do such a thing. He's done. Don't eat the melon. I'm on the hunt still, trying to sniff you out. Okay, I haven't gotten the Jeff messages that the Jeffs are coming, so maybe I'm okay. But the ultimate Jeff is on his way, and soon I will feast on you. You don't know where I am. Plus, you have until sunrise to find me, Sonny. Made up the new rule. Yeah, that's fair. I like that, because this map is huge. But I think I'm on to you. Are you shining a flashlight right now? No. <laughs> I spotted him, guys. Look at him in the woods, cowering. The Jeffs are coming. This is not good. I'm gonna pretend to be an NPC Jeff. Look at me. I'm moving so weird. Guys, there's a Jeff right there. Wait, this Jeff's moving really weirdly. This is totally sunny. Melon, where are you, bro? I can't find you. Good, let's keep it that way. No! And now I eat you! This is me! You can never beat me! I just have to survive until sunrise. Dude, how are you dodging me out? How do I even munch? You almost got me that time, Sonny. How do you even munch as Jeff? I'm clicking, I'm pressing spacebar, I'm pressing E. I'm doing everything right. Nothing's happening to you. <laughs> Yo, I'm just how Ow! Finally, I munched. And now I will keep munching. I will eat the melon. No! Okay, I have one more munch on me. Oh, you're done now. You better hope you find someone with a weapon quick. You don't even know where I am. Yeah, I'm right behind you, bro. Time to die! No! Now that was a delicious fruity treat. Well, Melon, well played, but this hide and seek goes to the Jeff. It's fine, because now I'm the Jeff, and you have until tomorrow's sunrise. But I'm still a Jeff. Just become a normal player. I shouldn't just fly to the moon and then tell you you can't find me. You're not allowed to do that. Fine, I accept my death, and I'm back alive as Sunny. And goats, I have a plan. I'm gonna use this hammer and see what other loot I can find in this house. Anything good? Crowbar, don't care. Food, don't really care. Oh no, the sun, it's already rising. It's fine. I'm just gonna go next.
next to this house and build a modified base. My own personal hideout. Melon will never suspect it. This is genius, goats. This is absolutely genius. Check this out. No Jeffs will get inside of my house. It's like a tent made of wood. And then I gotta close myself off really fast. Yes, I am now hidden perfectly. Melon cannot find me in here. All right, Melon, I'm ready. And that means I'm ready to find you. Sonny, first question, are you hiding towards the inskirts or the outskirts of the whole map? The inskirts, I guess, because I'm near a house. I have a feeling I know exactly what house you hid in. Really? Probably the one with the a million barriers. No. Hey, hello, Sonny. Are you hiding in here? Goats, he's at the wrong house, probably, because I'm in my own personal hideout made of wood. Hello. There's also an entire personal hideout made of wood. Wait, no. It's a tunnel connecting these two houses. Phew. That was close, Goats. I thought he was talking about me for a moment. That's actually so clever. Whatever. If you're in there, Sonny, that would really suck for me because it would be almost impossible for me to get into your base. Yeah, exactly. be impossible for you to get into my hideout. So let me ask, are you in this hideout, Sonny? I don't know where you are, so I'm gonna say no. Dang it. Actually, that's a good thing for me. I've just got to look out for you. Let's see. Any yellow suns around here? I've got quite a bit of height right now. He said he was hiding near a house. Sonny, what is the color of the house you're hiding near? The color of the house that's closest to me is blue. Blue house, and you're hiding close to it. There's a couple blue houses here, but there's actually quite a few blue houses. Not seeing him anywhere around here. Let's check a boot over here. No Sonny's hiding here either. Yeah, good luck finding me, Melon. This is gonna be tough. Sonny, did you build your own base? Maybe. Dang it. But it's attached to a house, so I didn't cheat. You built a base attached to a house. Yeah, and you got two minutes left to find me, bruh. I can't find this house anywhere. You'll know when you see it. Trust me. Are you close to the warehouse? I have no idea what I'm close to. <sighs> Wait a second, goats. Blue house. And it looks like there's something attached to this one. Melon, don't go towards the light. It's deadly in there. I'm going to eat you, Sonny. No, you're not. If you open this up, I'll kill you. No, you're not allowed. That's against the rules of the hide and seek. Yeah, I don't remember that rule. Where was it in the fine print? It was literally the first thing I said. Also, you can't even break in here, bro. You're munching powers are weak. How the heck do you munch as a Jeff? I don't think you can munch through all my planks, bro. I got too many. Plus, I'll just rebuild them. Oh, no. If my friends help me out, I can break through. I can't even see anything right now. This is terrifying. Break all the planks. Yes! Am I surrounded right now? No, you're totally fine. Don't worry. Okay, as long as I'm totally fine, I won't panic or scream. Die, Jeff! Get away from my house! No hitting the Jeffs! Gotta do what I gotta do. It's literally a roll! I can see them swarming! I gotta kill them all! Die! You die, Sonny! Let me munch! Hey, yo, chill! Oh, my health. I gotta get back into hiding. No, you coward. No hiding! No killing! You're such a cheater! It's hide and seek. You told me to hide, right? Yeah, but then you started killing me! Nah, I killed the other Jeffs. You literally just did more damage to me! Oh, are you dead? Are you dead yet? Sonny, you lost. <laughs> I don't know. Kind of feels like I won. No, you lost. It was the first thing I said. You can't kill the Jeff. I didn't hear it. Sorry. Guys, Sonny is such a cheater. He can't play anything fairly. He always has to win, but in the most unfair way. Hey, Melon, you know what's not unfair? No. Pressing the like button right now. You know what? That isn't unfair. You guys should totally press it. And if you want to get the ultimate win, head over to SonnyandMelon.com and check out our new merchandise. And holy smokes, look at the size of that, Jeff. Bruh, Melon, if you could be this guy, you would have been a winner. It's almost as big as our plushies. Make sure you buy yours now. The Giant Sunny and the Giant Melon Head. Today, Sunny and I become Jeff and Giant Evil Face. Our goal is to eat as many players as possible, but it won't be easy. As a Jeff, you actually have super low HP, so Sunny and I are gonna have to work together if we want to eat every player in Giant Evil Face. Sunny, where are you, bro? I'm in the middle of a house. I just picked up a hammer. It's time for me to protect myself from Jeffingtons. Bro, what the heck happened to this house? This house is more barrier than actual building. This is insane. And also, Melon, I'm seeing a bunch of planks throughout the streets. I didn't know you could do this. How did someone put planks? Bro, you could put these on the floor now. Bro, you have no idea what I'm looking at. I've never seen this many planks in my life. Dude, why is across the map there a button that says press E to pick up hammer? Is that you? What? No, that's not me. I'm gonna cross map, grab this hammer. Hold on. Find the sweet spot. Find the sweet spot. Come on, let me grab that hammer. Let me grab that ham. Uh, 
I guess it's just a weird glitch. I don't know. Dang it, Sunny. We need to gather tools. I've got nothing right now. I got two hammers, brother. I can give you one. There's a Jeff in here. There's a phone. Actually, I don't really- Oh, no. There's another Jeff. There's another Jeff. Stay away from me. Bro, you're right. I just found the house made of planks. What is this? Sonny, I'm about to get munched. No, let me out of here. No, no, no. He's coming for me. No! Sonny, help me! I'm in the house of planks, brother. I'm securing it with my homies. You don't understand, Sonny. I'm about to get killed. Well, that is just sad. Melon, respawn and come to the plank house. This is the safe spot. Okay, I respawned and I got a bat. This time I can defend myself. And yeah, I have that weird glitch. I can grab food across the map, but I can't really grab it. Yeah, it's okay. Just get in the plank house, bro. I'm securing it. I'm adding more layers. I think this is when the brute's gonna come out. There's way too much wood here, bro. The brute's gonna destroy us at nighttime. You think we could kill the brute? I think there's only one way to find out, Mel. Actually, I only have a hammer. I definitely cannot fight the brute. Yeah, I need to get a gun. I'll all I've got is a bat. I gotta get a giat, if you know what I'm saying. When I found you, Sonny, let's go get a giat. I'll take out these giafs. Sounds good. Melon, you, you immediately split up from me. You went the other way. No, I was in front, which means you left me. Sonny, there's so much loot in here. There's just a lot of Jeffs we have to take out. Okay, you do that. I'm gonna go to this glowing tree in the distance. I don't know why it's glowing like that. Maybe it has a special reward. My goodness, there's so many Jeffs in here. Melon, what do you think this tree's gonna have? Uh, hopefully a gun. I don't even know if I can get up to it. I might need you. I need to jump off your head. Bro, I can't really help you right now. I'm being surrounded by Geoffs. I hate when Geoffs are everywhere like that. Sonny, it's getting dark. You might want to get back to home base. Can't do it. I'm almost at the glowing tree. I'm so close. I can see it, Melon. I just got to find a way up now. Oh, you're dead, Woo. dude. The Jeffs are going to come and get you. Yeah, but if I could just get to the glowing tree, maybe I'll get a secret weapon. All right, that's it. I'm getting in. It's too scary. I'm in my bunker. It's right there, the glowing tree. I have to grab it. There's got to be a way to get up there. Uh, I think I found the edge of the world. Oh my gosh, I'm surrounded by Jeffs. It's over for me. I was gonna say, Sonny, it's saying run on my screen. Please tell me the brute isn't here. Uh-oh, I think I hear the brute. Where is it? No, nope, it's just a bunch of Jeffs. So far, we're chillin'. Ch you say. Oh no, that's the brute. That's the brute. The brute's after us, Sonny. I have teamed up with the brute and now I will munch. Can we take this brute out? It looks like he can't get through our base. Yeah, he's coming back in, bro. I'm watching him right now. He's about to eat someone. Take him out, boys. Shoot him. I'm eating this guy. I'm eating this guy. I almost killed him. What the heck? The brute killed me in one shot. Let's go. Munch, munch. Oh, I died. Melon, you want to become a Jeff and attack them with me? Yeah, kind of low-key do. For only 500 Robux. We're going in. We will become the real brutes. I wish you could pay even more Robux and actually be the giant brute. That'd be awesome, bro. Instead, I'm just a weak little Jeff. Okay, I'm nearby the house. I haven't entered yet. I'm waiting for you. I'm coming, Sonny. Dude, it's a lot easier to move around as a Jeff. It is. Going first person, though. You're looking as a see-through mouth. It's really weird. That is pretty strange. Sonny, I think we got to go in. This person's low. I'm going to take him out right here. Munch! This guy's only got a bat. Eat him! Eat him. Eat him good. Hit him, Sonny. Hit him where it hurts. I did some damage. I can't even hit him, bro. How the heck do you hit him? Yeah, I thought you just clicked to eat. Oh, I am dead. Yeah, me too. I'm going back, though. I ain't afraid. I ain't afraid of him. I'll come back as a Jeff as many times as I need to. This is the night of the haunted Jeff. We won't give up. Not until we munch on every player. How is he alive? Get this guy. I can't bite him. It's so hard to bite him as a Jeff. Dude, just let me eat. What the heck, bro? You're right. This is trash. One final time. Third time's a charm. I'll take him out. I just got to bite him one time. I got him. I got him, Melon. Good work. You distracted him and I ate him. Let's go. Now this guy's got to go next. Melon, help. I got him distracted. I'm trying. Trying to take him out here. Oh, no. I'm stuck on the planks. Um, I'm dead. I'm stuck on the planks. Uh, <laughs> this ain't good. Bro, I'm coming back as a watermelon. Only because being a Jeff is impossible. Yeah, dude. I'm, I'm stuck on nothing right now. And I got a black eye. It really hurts. I got some good loot right off rip. I got a chocolate bar, a crowbar, and a hammer. Yeah, I'm gonna have to reset my character. I'm back. And I got a crowbar already, too. Come on, I'll take on every single Jeff. Y'all got nothing on me. Die! Beat the Jeff up and then take the med kit. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. I'm too strong for these Jeffes. I'm gonna pop this soda and run. Nice. I just healed up full. No, I just wanna find a gun, bro. Oh, I found bonus ammo. I need a shotgun now, too. I got lots of ammo. Oh, this guy got me low. I gotta eat some chocolate. Dude, dude, this has gotta be a real player. This can't be a normal Jeff. Go away. Oh, pummeled him. Broke this Jeff wide open. Same here. But now I need a chocolate bar. There's three Jeffs in this house. Take them out one at a time. I'm at the top of a radio tower. This Jeff's trying to munch. How is there no weapons up here? There should be a shotgun waiting. 
waiting. Yes, I found myself a gun, finally. Now I can take these Jeffs out with ease. Oh, I'm wrecking this Jeff. You want a piece of me? Come and get the whole thing! Splatted him. He almost got me there. Let me finish off this Jeff. I'm one shot. Will you capture or let it slip? I'm one Jeff bite away from death. Need to find myself a chocolate bar. Same, broski. This has been tough out here. There's no loot anywhere. I gotta find a new section of the map that's not touched. Oh, I'm going to the store, brother. Have you ever visited that place? I've never even seen it. This is a store? Yeah, I'm heading to it right now. Where do you see a store? It's on the edge of the world. There's a random blue block. It says store on it, and it's like really light blue, almost white. I don't see it, Sonny. And I got a bad feeling there's no way inside. Holy Jeffs! I've never seen this many melon! I'm dead. I found the store, Sonny. I'm going in. Is there even an entrance? No, there's not. Son oh, yeah, now I know you're talking about. I don't think there's an entrance here. Yeah, that was rather unfortunate, but I respawned and found a chocolate bar and a baseball bat. Well, I found the Jeffs you were talking about. I'm pretty sure those are real players. Dude, there was like 20 of them. This Jeff is just flying into the sky. I've got to take out all these Jeffs. It must be done. Yeah... Good luck. Gotta enter this store. There's a whole lot of Jeffs, though. The heck, they disappeared out of nowhere. What the heck is this? You're right, Sonny. What is this? I told you. No. Why did 20 Jeffs just spawn out of nowhere? They're protecting the store, I guess. Oh, no. The sun is setting. Kill the Jeff. Kill the stupid Jeff. Eat my dang chocolates. I had to revive with all my stuff, but I'm nowhere near the store now. I got some good cash on me, but I still need a gun, bro. Where are the weapons? I only got a baseball bat. What the heck? Why do I see an invisible player right now? What am I looking at here. There's a lot of items on the floor here. Can I loot this? Wait, what the heck, body? Sonny? I can see the outline of your body. And I see the outline of your body, bro. Your arm's glowing. I know, bro. I can see you from across the map. Okay, Melon, we gotta board this up. It's nighttime. Help me out here. You have a lamp. Can you put down some light? Sonny, just walk outside. It's okay. I got a flashlight. I'm chilling. Just walk outside, Sonny. I'm telling you. Okay. I'm outside. Oh. <laughs> nice one. It's time to assemble a fort. The fortress is inside, Melon. You must just step inside. Barriers. Barriers! The Jeff is gonna get in! Where's the brute? Oh, that's the brute. We just heard him. Hold. Nothing can possibly go wrong. I'll take the brute out myself, Sonny. I think that's a very bad idea. Let me at him. Let me at him. All right, I'm right behind you, Melon. Sonny, I'm shooting him. I got my baseball bat out. Let's go! Ow, let me move. Ow. Well, I died. Good luck, Melon. You're on your own. How the heck are you supposed to take that dude out? By Pressing the like button <laughs> and subscribing. Do it right now. I'm going out with glory though, Sonny. Brute, you're going down. You oh, died. He killed me. You died. He didn't killed you? me in one shot. Yes, he did. We're back to battle the giant evil faces in Roblox Jeff. Can we find enough weapons to defend ourselves when it's nighttime? Because at midnight, we'll be fighting against the cursed brute Jeff. This guy is way too Sigma. Can you help us by pressing the like button? Do it now to get goaded. Sonny, the Jeffs are attacking. I've got myself a crowbar and a chocolate bar. That's nice, Melon. Over the first night, I died. Jeff ate me five times times, but now I've woken up and it's time for a new life. I got a hammer and a chocolate bar. Let's go, Sonny. I've got two bars as well. Where exactly are we going, Melon? We've got to link up if we're gonna survive. Meet up with me, Sonny. Right by the tree. There's a lot of trees, you idiot. Okay, well, fine. Let me be more descriptive about this tree. This tree is brown, brown trunk, and green leaves. Okay, brown trunk, green leaves. Well, I have a GPS. Let me see if I can locate a brown trunk and green leaves. Uh, Melon, they're all brown and green. Okay, this one's a little bit bigger than the rest of the trees. Like, I'd say 30% larger. Okay, this is just dumb. I'm gonna go and look for a weapon inside of this facility over here. I found a big gray concrete building. It might be the hospital. Oh, I found that too. Look at that, Sonny. Where you at, brother? We gotta link up if we're gonna survive the Jeffs. Oh, where am I at? I am by a tree. Brown and green tree. Okay, I'm not listening. Sonny, I found you! I found you, Sonny! It was all because of my tree shout-out! Whatever. I got a shotgun, so we're gonna be fine. And I've got two bars. A chocolate bar and a crowbar. And watch this Jeff right here. Obliterate! Yo, chill, Sonny. Don't waste your ammo on him. Let me finish him. Mellet, Mellet, Mellet. He's gonna bite me. I got him. Don't even worry about it. Nice work. He didn't drop any cash, though. That would have been nice. How do we get upstairs here, Shani? Uh, I think we look for the staircase, which is right over here. Okay, there's a Jeff over there. I saw him through the window. I'm not afraid of no Jeffs. I'm gonna blast him, because I don't have a weapon. Yeah, you do. You have a shotgun, Sonny. I meant I have no melee weapon. Yeah, let me go in. I 
Could have done it. Well, nice. At least you got the chocolate bar. Let's see. Is there more ammunition or something else over here we could use overnight? <sighs> Bro, we've never been on top of the building. Yeah, what the heck? I didn't even know you could get on the roof. Let's go. Let's defend ourselves up here tonight. It sounds like a terrible idea, Sonny. Why? What could possibly go wrong? I could list a lot of things that are gonna go wrong if we stay up on this roof. Well, why don't we try and hide on one of your trees? You seem to really like them. Going for it! Oh. Never mind. Yeah, I was gonna say, you probably can't make that. Sonny, I'm gonna continue looting. I need to get myself a gun if I want to survive. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. And I'm gonna need to get myself a melee weapon also if I want to survive. Also, what do upgrades cost? Let's see. Hundred dollars. I don't have that kind of money. Really? I've maxed out all my upgrades. Wait, what? You did pay to win! Let me do that. Thousand Robux. Let's go. You're telling me you haven't had eight inventory slots this whole time? No. What about the game passes? Oh, I already got that. <gasps> Except I need better stamina. Yes. Now I can run for an eternity. All right, that feels much better, Melon. I got a lot of upgrades there. Jeff, die. Oh no, Sonny, the sun is setting. And that means the Jeffs are coming. As long as the Mega Jeff doesn't show up, we should be okay. I got a lamp in here. I'll set up base. This is a terrible base. There's a lot of windows for us to board up. It's okay, you've got a shotgun. I've got a crowbar. We can do this. Okay, Melon, start boarding up. Do you have a hammer? No, I don't. Oh, we are dead. How am I gonna be the only one to put planks down? You've got this, Sonny. Don't stress. Okay, I got this. He says I got this, so I got this. All right, cover the windows. Melon, watch the other side, okay? I'm gotten this one right now. As long as you got it, I got you. You know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, brother. I know what you're saying. One more window I gotta got up. Oh, we're fine. We're chilling. Now, let's see. Are the Jeffs gonna raid us tonight? They wouldn't dream of it, Melon. Uh, Melon? They dreamt of it. They dreamt of it! The Jeffs are here! Uh, I don't see any Jeffs, Sonny. I think we're fine. I'm just gonna keep boarding up. Um, Sonny? Sonny, the big Jeff is here! Oh, no! Jeff's just gotta board it up! Sonny! I'll kill him! Shoot him! I'm trying! This guy's a beefcake! He killed me in one shot. It's okay, we got him trapped now. We got him right where we want him. He's eating the house. Ooh. He disappeared. You killed him! Or I did! Wait, did we actually kill the brute? I think, Melon, your watermelon rind was poisoned. And it mortared him. I can't believe it. We did it, Sonny. I poisoned and killed the brute. Yeah, it's because you taste disgusting, bro. I hope we killed him at least. That was terrifying, Sonny. Why did that have to happen? Yeah, I don't understand why he disappeared. I think he killed me and then was like, I'm good. To be fair, I blasted him four times with my shotgun. Do you think that's enough damage? Uh, I feel like he'd probably take a few more shots than that. Yeah, you're right. Either way, Melon, I felt pretty good about that one. We destroyed the brute, Jeff. That we did, Sonny. Watch out, Melon, behind you! Take him out! He's gone, and he dropped some money. Give me that. Now, Sonny, we just gotta wait out the rest of the night. We don't have to wait out anything. Melon, get that torch. Let's go on an adventure. You're crazy, Sonny, and I'm with that. Let's roll. I got your back. I got ten more shots. We'll be fine. All right, well, where are we exploring? Right here. Look at all this loot. Give me this chocolate. Food, some bullets, some money. I'm eating chocolate. Give me a second. There we go. Oh, Jeff. Jeff. Die, Jeff! Jeff's dead. Exploded. There's another lantern there. I'll hold on to that one. A melon! The sun's rising already! We're good! We're actually big chillin'. I can't believe it. We survived the brute, potentially killed the brute, and conquered the night. Dude, that was easy peasy. There's a lot of Jeffs on the loose, though. I'm cleaning them up. Goodbye. Oh, this is satisfying. Oh, you want some of this? Get over here! I just realized you have a flashlight in this game automatically. Yeah, melon, there's a lot of Jeffs in this building. I'm about to pop them. Like pimples. One, two. Oh! I killed four of them in one hit! That's crazy, Sonny! Goodbye. I'm the Jeff Buster. Also, what's up with this building? This thing is crazy. Bro, whoever did this must have been attacked by the brute at some point in time. They must have gotten so scared and then hunkered down like crazy. Yeah, I think they're still in there somewhere. I still don't have a melee weapon and I'm out of ammo. You're on your own, Melon. Ow. Oh my goodness, that guy got me low. Good thing I have a med kit. And if you need, you could eat this chocolate. It's okay, I don't need the chocolate, Sonny. I have four chocolate bars now. Nice. I got some ammo, but it's for the wrong weapon. I need shotgun shells. Yeah, I can't believe I haven't found any weapon yet. This is bonkers. Dude, this house is boarded up like crazy. But there's still no melee weapons or ammo boxes. All right, I'm gonna climb up this here water house. Hopefully there's something. Oh, there's a Jeff up there, Melon. Be careful. There's a Jeff, that means there's probably some Jaloot. You're right, there's money. Money, 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 money. Give me, give me, give me. On oh, a hammer. There we go. I can start building the bases now as well. I think I'm dead, bro. This Jeff won't leave me alone. Get off of me, Jeff! Ow. Sonny, come back. Come back to me. I can whack him. Uh, it's too late for me. No! Sonny! 
goats, I have no choice. I have to accept my death and respawn as one of them. Yes. Now, where's that melon? Let's see what's in here. Okay, got another crowbar, another hammer. That would have been good for you, Sonny. Melon. A lot of things would be good for me. Like what? Oh, <laughs> uh, Sonny? Are you this chef right here? Die, Melon! Let me chomp! Ch Bro! Really? You just got destroyed! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So funny. Just you wait. Just you wait. Bro, these Jeffs are so annoying. Ow, he just bit me again. How are you alive? I got lots of chocolate on me. Once I find myself a weapon, no one will ever be able to hurt me. Oh, but I will. I am the weapon. I am the one who bites. Sonny, I see you over there. You're the one Jeff flying super high. No, I am not flying super high. Dude, you're still hunting me. Of course. I gotta get to the store. Of course I'm hunting you. Look at me. Look into my eyes. Oh my goodness, you're all the way up there. Bring it on, Sonny. Oh yeah. Yeah. Surprise attack. Dude, you're bad, Jeff. Let me say that much. D d d d just jump. Jump. Dude, you just got destroyed. I give up. Being a Jeff sucks. Being a guy that kills the Jeff is awesome. But you know what's even more awesome? Pressing like and subscribe. Do it now. Today in Roblox, Jeff. We're building the ultimate maximum security base to survive from the giant evil faces. Did you know that you can build planks and structures anywhere in the world? We're literally making such a crazy base in the forest. 5,000 likes for more Jeff funny moments. Let's get goaded. Dang it, Melon, you brought us back to Roblox Jeff, and these giant evil faces are about to attack. The sun is setting. This isn't good, Sonny. We haven't even had a chance to build our most secure base yet. Bro, track down a hammer, and let's meet up. Turn on your flashlight. It's time to find some loot. Oh, Sonny, first thing I found was a hammer. Let's go. You are so lucky, I found a chocolate bar, but that's okay. I'll send it to Mr. Beast. And I got a shotgun. Oh, it's been a while since I've found some heavy artillery like this. I got myself a crowbar and a chocolate bar as well, Sonny. I'm pretty looted up right now. Nice. Whereabouts are you? I'm trying to track you down. Uh, I found some ammo in here. I couldn't describe it, Sonny. I'm in a house. A blue house. Okay, I'll find blue houses after I blast this Jeff away! Wait, Sonny. I think I'm near you. I heard a shotgun go off. Yeah, that's me. I'm in a big hospital building. Okay, I just killed a Jeff with a crowbar single-handedly. Oh, more ammo. Let's go. Oh, that's for regular guns, though. Not for my shoddy. Sonny, I'm running towards the sound of your shotgun right now. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. I don't have a hammer or any place to protect. I'm just on top of the roof like an idiot. Oh, I can't see anything, though. Are you in here? Oh, no. There's some Jeffs in there. I'm outside, Melon. I don't know where you are, Sonny. I don't see a giant hospital. Oh, I thought you heard my shotties. Can you shoot it again? I just heard it. Hold on. I'm running towards it. You can see a light. I'm on the streets. I, see I hear you. Melon, do the flashlight. Sonny! I found you, brother! And now let's find a place to hold up for the night. What, do you want to go here? There's a lot of windows, but we could hold down the fort. I don't even have a hammer yet, so bad idea. Well, we need to find you a hammer so then we can both build the most secure base. Perhaps in here? No. No hammers. But there's a Jeff! Beat him up! Ooh, that Jeff didn't even stand a chance, Brody. Not even close. Oh, hammer. Got it. Let's go. Where do you want to secure this base, Sonny? I'm thinking over here somewhere. Let's find a smaller house with less windows. Uh, handgun. Oh! <laughs> Melon, I'm stacked. I've never had this much loot. I have so much ammunition, too. Dang it, Sonny. I need a gun. I'm defenseless with my crowbar. Don't worry. I got you, bro. I got you. Should we just build our own base? Can you do that? Hold on. Hammer time. Bro, build a bunker out here. This is going to be really hard to do, Sonny. Not if you click fast enough. I never knew you could do this. This is epic, bro. Are you going to help or just look at me? You can't build any elevation, Sonny. You're just going to build a clobba jabba of wooden planks. What do you mean a clobba? Java. I'm literally building like a little house right now. Look at this. Loki, right, Sonny. We are gonna build the most secure house you've ever seen. Yeah, dude, it's all planks. There's no way they could break through it. It's kind of like camping, bro. We're making a tent. Dude, this is awesome. This truly will be the most secure base. How do we want to get inside of it, though? We should probably make like a door area out here. Yeah, hold on. I'll work on the roof. Yeah, you work on the roof. I'm just gonna keep building this lengthways, and then at the last second, we could close the front door if we're worried. Oh, this is awesome, bro. We're actually building our own house. House. I didn't know this was possible. I will fortify the exterior. Sonny, we should build a wall. Great big wall around us. That's what I'm working on right now. Plaster the house fully. In a moat. We need a lava moat as well. Bro, how are you going to get a lava moat in Jeff? 
Get a lava bucket. Yeah, let me get right on that. Make sure you have a water bucket. Oh, wait, I'll just punch your head. You're a watermelon. Shut up, Sonny. I'm building the great big wall around us. Nice. I'm fortifying, bro. This is insane. Look at this clobba java like you called it, bro. This thing is a behemoth. When night two sets, the Jeffs have no chance to find us. No chance at all. Check out this wall. I'm securing the other side of our fortress right now. We should tell the other players to find us. Look for our base in the woods if you need sanctuary. Sonny, I'm spamming wood down so fast right now. It's insane. All right, let's see this from the inside. How do we look in here? Bro, our base is so awesome. I know. When night two sets in, Sonny, these Jeffs are not getting in. This is actually the coolest idea we've ever had. Yes. Yes. Probably your coolest idea ever, though. Thank you. I don't know why I'm building a wall considering Jeffs can fly. It's okay. It's intimidation. It's also about telling the other players in the server where we are. It's about hope, inspiration. I hear someone nearby with a weapon. Maybe they'll join us. When they see the Kalaba Jabba, they must. Join us in the woods. It is safe here. It really is, though. This is crazy. Check it out, Sonny. We've actually made our own little teepee hut. Bro, this is actually such an awesome creation. But it'd be a real shame if someone threw a match in here. Yeah, that would really suck. Good thing that doesn't exist in Giant Evil Face. Yeah, if there was a little bit of fire, we would be deaded. Oh, wait, Melon, we're missing something. We gotta go get a lantern. I'll be right back. Sonny, you go get a lantern. I'll continue to work on the wall. Die, Jeff. Die. Kind of looks like an egg. Oh, lantern and a chocolate bar. Oh, that's epic. Give me this, some food. And Melon, I'm gonna have to drop one of my chocolate bars for the lantern. Where do you want this? Inside of the base or on the top? I think I'm gonna put one on the top like this. I'm gonna go look for another one. Bro, this is awesome. We're the beacon of light in the woods. The sun might be setting soon though, Sonny. Be careful. I found a new recruit, bro. He's been putting planks all over the road. Maybe I can bring him over. Say, follow me. I'm making a path. It's like a breadcrumb trail. Melon, and look, I'm guiding the players. We're gonna save the world. All right. Well, you might want to get in here because the sun is setting. I recruited him. Nando's. Do you want some chicken? Ooh, some chicken could go. Oh, yummy. Now, let's just hope he doesn't betray us. Yeah. No. Yes, exactly. Is that you? Yeah, I did that. I'm not even going to cap. Okay. Well, that was a bit silly. I don't even have a crowbar, so I'm dependent on you to let me out. Oh, I can't even get out of here, Sonny. You're breaking all the wrong stuff, aren't you? I don't know. I can't even see. Great. Well, the good news is we are going to be safe in here. Why don't you tell me a spooky ghost story? Once upon a time, a sunny and a melon went into a clabba jabba hut, but they couldn't escape because some idiot put a plank in the way. Oh, and then the idiot removed the plank. They stepped outside and saw nothing in the world. It was a peaceful night and nothing scary happened at all. Uh oh, the Jeffs. Jeffs are attacking! I take back everything! Get in! Get in! They can't possibly penetrate the clabba jabba, Sonny. Don't worry. Bro, there are so many up here. Time for me to light him up. Be careful, Sonny. I'm not scared of him. Oh! I'll go out with my crowbar in hand. Nice work. Now I gotta eat a chocolate because they hurt me. They bit my melon a little bit. Yeah, they were just looking for some hydration. Well, Melon, I think our little bunker is surviving. Unless one of those giant Jeffs show up, we should be fine. Yeah, I think we're actually big Chihillin. Hold on, I'm gonna put our lantern outside to see if we can attract any more friendlies. Hello, fellow goats of the lobby. Come to our clobber jobber hut. This is actually the most OP strategy. I know. Now, Sonny, I've got to make the clobber jobber tower. I'll see you in space. Yeah, good luck with that. I'm going up on a Tuesday. Well, and the good news is I think we survived all the Jeffs. We did, Sonny. We wrecked those Jeffs. They really didn't stand much of a chance. Let me see if there's any more nearby. Hello? Jeffries? No? I think we're good. I think we intimidated them. They quit. The Jeffs gave up. Let's go. I'm bringing a new recruit, though. Follow me. Follow. I alone stand at the top of the Klaba Jabba. Well played. I have brought another Bryce Blocks. We are protecting the players of this world. Look at it. A beautiful fortress. Wow. Sonny, you really are making a sanctuary here in Giant Evil Face. I am. I'm just trying to protect the people. This bunker is for the people. Oh, he quit. That guy quit. He saw the bunker and he said, I'll never be that good at Jeff. So he left. He realized it was too beautiful, Sonny. Oh, bro, you are really traveling. Told you, Sonny. I'm going to space. Now, I wonder what happens if I grab a crowbar and peel away one of the blocks at the bottom. 
Good luck, bro. That is like 18 planks thick. But I wonder if there's physics or if it's like Minecraft and you'll just keep floating. Get off me, Jeff. This is truly the most beautiful fortress I've ever seen, Sonny. It's the only fortress I've ever seen built like that. I won't even cap. I've never seen someone do that. No, there is physics. I just fell. <laughs> Did the whole tower collapse? Yeah, what the heck just happened? Oh, that is awesome. I wish I was there to see it. Dang it. How does that even work? And I also got sent flying. Oh, yeah. He just hit it once with his crowbar. And he took you out? Yeah. Gosh darn it, Nandos. You know what else he should hit once with a crowbar? That subscribe button. Press it now. And stick around for more epic Roblox Jeff. Today, I become a spider melon. Or a melon spider? Either way, my goal as the spider is to let nobody escape. Not even Sunny. Who's the spider gonna pick, Sunny? Please be me. Well, we got a two out of three chance. Imagine if it's the girl. It looks like the spider melon's coming out to play. Oh, no. I hate when you get the spider. You're too good at it. Yes. It's time to kill you all. At least I got Uncle Bob's help. He's gonna keep me safe. I really hope I get to kill you. I've never seen the spider actually win. And you still won't. Red key, open the red door. Oh, I'm clutching up, Melon. Yes, I will unlock all of the doors before you're even released. Come on. Oh no, the spider's here. <laughs> it's time to murder you. Too late, I've already opened another door, Melon. Dang it, bro, you can't be opening all these doors. But I can, brother. I will unlock everything before you're up here. I'm gonna have to cook you. You give me no choice. Who are you cooking? Better not be me. I'm cooking you. I'm gonna cook you. Nah, I'm not sweating it, Melon. Not even a little bit. Now, where are you? Where is this little spoiler lurking in the shadows? No! What's up? Oh, I'm fine, bro. You missed your chance. Dude, you stepped in one of my cobwebs. Why do you think I screamed? Dang it. I'm just trying to devour you. Let me eat. I cannot, and I will not let you eat. I'm back in the house. Sorry. Sorry, bruh. Dang it. And I won't fall for any more of your traps. Sure you won't. Uh, this ain't good. Hey, Sonny. <sighs> it's time to feast. No, Mella, please, please. We can talk about this. Mella, please stop. Mella, please let me go. You have but one opportunity left, and then I will munch you. Oh, no. I have no health left. Oh, no, my teammate. My poor teammate. I'll free you. What the heck? Why doesn't it tell me when you step in one of my traps? Get trapped. Old, bruh. You don't have spider vision. Oh, she's dead, though. She doesn't have the wrench. No way. Dang it, bro. I was hoping your spidey senses were too weak. And now I consume the noob. Oh, delicious. Truly. Dang it. Where's the crowbar? I need that, and I need a ladder. It's time to mancho. Melon, you're scaring me. If anything, I should be scared of you. I'm a spider, after all. Yeah, why don't I just step on you and squish you? Yeah, do that. Step on me, I dare you. I don't want to. You're too big. You're a huge, giant spoiler. Come on, crowbar. Where is it? You can run, but you cannot hide, Sonny. You're so cursed, bro. Go away. At least I got teammates now. You may have the teammates, but you are going to die here, Sonny. Mark my words. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Juke him! No! Melon, my team, my team's gonna win the game. You totally gotta go get them. My team's gonna win. Oh, uh, nope. It's too late. I munch you. Dang it. I gave you a chance to live, and now I taketh away that chance. Oh, yeah? There's always a chance. Goats, I'm gonna copy this link and sign in on an alt account. All right. Where's this last person? I need to clean this up and get the first spider dub. Climb up here. Eat them. Consume them all. What the heck? How did this person get away from me? Oh, they're done for. They're done for now. Oh, yes! Mum, num, num, num. Nom, 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 nom. Deliciousness. And I have cornered the last one to the front yard. Where be they hiding? Melon, take your time. There's no rush. Heck, I'm confused right now. Where did this last player go? Oh, they're right over here. Thank you for not moving. Oh, it's time to eat. Melon, chill. And I've consumed. Is that everybody? Is there still time? The heck, why is there still time in the game? I killed everybody. Yes, there's still time. Melon, just you wait, brother. Someone still in the game. That's why. Yeah. Someone's still in the game. Come on. Relog. I hope this works. It worked. Goats, I'm back in on Buzz's account. Oh, wait. This isn't the same game with Melon. What the heck? I think this last player is upstairs. I must consume them. Wait. Why does it say Buzz joined me? 
<laughs> yes, I got on Buzz's account so I could win. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm dang serious, brother. Bro, I can't eat you guys. This is so annoying. Oh, did you think you were going to win as a spoiler for the first time ever? Yes, I did. You people can't even escape the main room. <laughs> this is a bit toxic what you're doing here, Melon. <laughs> Don't be mad. Don't hate the spider. Hate the game. Yeah, also, why is there no crowbar or ladder? Get over here. Someone just hit my nets. No, Buzz, get over here. Get over here. No. I'm making the escape. Are you kidding me? You still have more webs. <laughs> And now I eat the bacon head, Noob. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's the crowbar? Noob is dead. All that remains is the buzz. This is very bad. Hey, at least they cleared out the web. Why is the web still there? Oh, they didn't clear out their web. They let me eat them before that happened. That is really, really bad. Yes, indeed it is. Melon, you think I didn't see you climbing the wall? Yes, I know you didn't see that. Get over here! What am I supposed to do with this sticking wrench? Ah! -ha -ha! Bro, you just dropped from the ceiling. Dang it. It's so hard to catch up to you. Yeah, and it's so hard to play this game. You have webs everywhere. Yes, I placed my webs in tactical spots. No! And I believe that's the game. The Spider-Man is too strong. Wait, maybe I can hit you with a wrench. Hit him with a wrench. Dance on him. Dance on him. I tried to cheat and I still lost. That's it. It's a spider dub. I think. Why is the time still ticking? Hey, should I join on another account? I swear if you join on another account, Sonny. Yeah, there might be enough time. Let me give it a go. Oh, Melon, how much time's left? There's a minute and 40 seconds. Even if you get back, there's no way you have time to escape. Oh, but there is. Come on, I can do the most clutch play of all time. I'm in! There's no way you're in again. Are you serious as Fluffy this time? Yeah, I never give up, bro. I never back down. I'm out of spider webs. Now it's gonna be really hard to catch you. I can actually play the game is what you're saying? Get over here. You don't even know what to do with the wrench. I need to find the stinking crowbar. Where is it? At least I figured out where the ladder is, goats. But I gotta move quickly. Into the basement, through the bunker. Come on. Yes, deactivate the laser system. And now I have access to the yellow key. No. Get over here. I won't let you. You don't have a choice, Melon. I'm speed running. The only problem is I got a lot of work to do in 35 seconds. Yeah, there's no way you have time to escape. I could just sit in AFK. Yeah, why don't you do that, huh? Why don't you AFK? All right, I'll do that right here. Perfect. 25 seconds to win. I got this. I got this. I put the ladder upstairs, and then I speed run the vault, open the combination of the safe. Everything's gonna be chill. Guys, he doesn't realize he hasn't even done the shed yet. And then I uh, have five seconds. This is it. I'll use the battery on the main entrance. That This is it. I'll use the battery on the main exit, and I'm dead. The survivors ran out of time. Good job, Spider W. No matter how many accounts Accounts I relogged with, it wasn't enough. Now, Sonny, let's show him how to win as a non spider. All right, let me get back on my real account. There we go. I'm in the queue. Here comes the spider. Who will be the chosen one? Imagine it's me again. I hope not. You're way too good at it. Oh no. It looks like it's a bacon hair. That's perfect, Melon. We should be able to speedrun this game as long as we avoid her cobwebs. And hopefully we can skip all this nonsense. Excellent. They're all professionals and they all skipped. Let's go. Melon, we got 30 seconds to speed run before this thing wakes up. All right, all right, all right. Um, what do we grab? Red key, red key in the red door. Let's go. Got the blue key. Checking upstairs. Blue key's upstairs, Sonny. Yep, I'm on the way with the blue key for it. Got it. Now I got the green key. But Melon, we gotta get to the backyard for the ladder. It should be next to the grave site. I've already got myself a wrench. Very good. Wait, someone already opened this up too? Are you serious, guys? The spider's coming and you're all camping the same area? What is this? So the spider's downstairs. Yeah, but all of our teammates were upstairs in the same spot. So? I just don't know what they're doing. They're kind of AFK. Whatever. I got the green key for the shed, and it's open. And now I got the yellow key. Okay. Yellow key means we have to open the vault. Where's the ladder? I don't know, Melon. I'm looking for it. Oh, no. Oh, Sonny, I gotta juke the spider here. Oh, that was so close. I almost got caught. I found the ladder. I'm gonna put it down now. It goes upstairs, but be careful the spider's there. Also, the room downstairs opposite the bunker has two keys in it. So I think the spider's lagging. Yeah, someone ain't right here. Are they just debating? Oh, they're gone. Yeah. Is there no more spider? Uh, two players DC'd and now there's a new spider. 
Uh oh. It's an astro spider. Climb up. Anything up here that we need? A C4, bro. We can open up the vault. Grab the wrench. I got it. Let's roll. You're darn tootin' right. Let's roll. I'm with you, brother. We gotta get out of here, but keep an eye out for cobwebs. This new spider looked a lot smarter. I've always wanted to do this. It's time to blow up the vault. Yeah. I need a win. Let's go. A A A. And we got the battery. Nice work. I'll go grab the yellow key from upstairs. It's right up this ladder next to the bunker entrance. All right. Sweet beans, Sonny. And I've deployed the battery. Flip the switch. All we need is the key now. Well done. One of our teammates is getting eaten by the spider. I got to open the yellow vault up quickly. Got it. And I got the purple key. That's what we need to escape, Sonny. This is actually a speed run. No way. Are we out of here? Are we low key out of here? We're already out. Bro, what about the loot upstairs? Did we not even need that? Nope. We're chilling. Melon, I want to see what the loot was, though. It's bug spray. Oh, I'm going to get myself some bug spray. Yes. And then I'm going to spray the spider on the way out, Melon. I'm going to be the exterminator. This is totally worth it. Totally worth it. Bug spray acquired, Melon. And here it comes. Spray. Why isn't it spray forwards? What the heck was that? It sprayed sideways. You missed. Yeah, it's okay. I'm still leaving. Yep. I made the great escape with you, Melon. We did it. I showed you a spider win, and then we showed you a non-spider win. Yeah, it was the ultimate speed run, bro. That was nuts. And you know what else is nuts? Pressing the like button to support our channel and visiting sunnyandmelon.com to check out our plushies and collectible toys. We unlocked the sledgehammer in Roblox listeners. This thing is insanely OP as it lets you hit multiple listeners at once. But just how many can we kill? Sonny, we've got to find the ultimate weapon. That's right. It's early in the morning here on the listeners, and if we can get our hands on a gun, we'll be able to do the ultimate insider move. Yeah. We'll raid people's bases. Because if you have that gun, it attracts every single listener in the game, pretty much. That's right. And then we could use it to destroy the player's base. Now, let's see around here. Fortunately, I had to kill off a couple of listeners as I look for the gun. Yeah. I have not run into any yet, but I also have not run into the gun yet. I got myself a hammer and a baseball bat. That's it. Now, keep in mind, Sonny, this gun is pretty rare, so we're going to have to look through a lot of buildings. Yeah, I could see that. I I got canned peaches, though. Let me eat these. Mm, that was good. And more money in here. I mean, might as well take the money. And I'm in the hospital. I think there's a bunch of loot in here. Yeah, I keep seeing a million baseball bats, but no guns. Come on. It's probably like a 1% drop. Bro, I feel like some of these listeners are actually players. This guy is following me everywhere. It's impossible. He has to hear you move. He definitely can. So I'm gonna beat him up with a bat. Sonny, where are you? I think we should probably meet up as well. I'm not too sure. Oh, Wait, Melon, I see you. You're off in the distance there. Hello. I'm chilling with these listeners. You might want to kill them listeners. Oh, I am killing these here listeners. Oh, splatted them. Sonny, how much health do you have? Uh, 50 health, but there's a couple more listeners coming in. Ow, kill it. Sonny, this guy's coming in too. I'll take him out for you. Yeah, that's your problem now. The heck, he's running away. This guy's definitely a player, bro. He's running from me. Sonny, where'd you go? You just disappeared. I went in the house. I'm trying to find the gun for us. Which house? There's about a million houses around us. I'm right behind you. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's explore this house right over here. That sounds like a decent idea. Nothing's in here, Sonny. Well, let's check all four of these out. You never said it'd be easy. Yeah. In fact, I said it'd be very hard. Which is why I'm eating some snacks. I'm gonna eat some canned chicken. That sounds disgusting. Canned chicken? Ugh. You gotta do what you gotta do sometimes to get your protein in. <gasps> I found the- Oh, dang it. I thought it was a gun. It's just a crowbar. Bruh. Uh, come on. Don't get us so hyped up like that. That was the most disappointing thing ever. Melon, follow me out here. I got a feeling this cabin down the road is going to have a gun. Melon? Melon, why didn't you follow me? I was inside the house. Sorry, I was sorting out my inventory. I'm a coming though, Sonny. I'm a coming. I'm looking for the gyat. I don't see it. There are listeners invading this place like crazy though. Ah! I got to get inside this other house right now. Sonny, they can get inside the house. It's fine. I'm going upstairs. They can't get me up here easily. Yes, they can. Oh, they're eating the floors. I'm going in this. Sewers, I'm dead. I'm dead too. The crowbar isn't even a weapon. 
Bruh, it's just for peeling planks off of walls, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Well, Melon, this gun, is it even real? Yes, it is. We just gotta keep searching for it. Trust me, sonny. I found it twice in my lifetime career as a listener player. Well, perhaps it's in the sewers? Just keep on searching, sonny. I am. I'm on the hunt. I'm not giving up. But I am gonna go check the sewers now. Let's see. Is there a special weapon lurking in the shadows? I'm in an old rusty pipeline. It smells disgusting in here, but there's no loot. Yeah, there isn't a whole lot of loot in the sewers. I think your best bet is to check the houses. There might not be a lot of loot in the sewers, but I got a lantern in this house right after. Hey, that's pretty solid. Yep, I can see at night, even if the sun's setting. Oh no, this is not good. The sun's already setting and we didn't find the gun, Sonny. We can't troll people's bases hard. It's okay, Melon. If we find a weapon, we can bunker down and just look out for ourselves. We could survive as many nights as possible. You don't understand what the night is like in the listeners, Sonny. It's the most brutal thing to survive. Oh yeah, well I got a crowbar. Oh! The listeners are here, Melon! Take him out quickly, quickly! I'm trying to help. All right, hopefully no more. Oh, we're done. We're actually dusted. Just slap him. Wombo combo. Sonny, every time a listener dies, he explodes and attracts more listeners. Get to the sewers. I'm trying. Let me in. Melon, Melon, we made it. Oh my goodness. But be careful. There's more listeners down here. Melon, I think they're trying to break their way inside. Be quiet, Sonny. I'm just checking the surface, and it's totally cooked up here. I'm coming back down. Okay, maybe there's a gun down here somewhere. Sonny, why am I so slow? Because you were crouching? I can't even move when I crouch. Melon, there's a listener over here. Do we kill it? Good. I don't think it's going to give us anything good, though. Sonny! I'm dead. Why? Why did they all just come down from the ceiling? That's insane. That is redonkulous. I got to barricade myself. No! Bro, these guys are so cursed. But I'm not giving up on the hunt, Melon. I will find this piece. And when I have the gyat, I might have to shoot you with it. No, don't shoot me with it. Shoot the listeners. Dude, these listeners won't leave me alone. I'm actually having quite the peaceful time right now. I guess you're just fighting all of them. Yeah, bro. Oh my goodness. They, they destroyed the entire building. Well, Melon, thank you for your service. It's appreciated. I'm dead again. And I'm checking the hospital. Maybe there's some fresh spawns. Dude, where's the loot ski? Bruh, how rare is the goon? I don't know, but clearly it's pretty rare. I'm also gonna pay 20 Robux for a brighter flashlight. That's why I'm just carrying around a lantern. Kinda does the same thing. I'm gonna pay 500 Robux for a sledgehammer. I wonder what this thing does. Bro, leave me alone. You can't even hear me. Ah. Uh... I gotta run for my life. Yes, I have a sledgehammer, Sonny. Not bad. Maybe you can KO all these listeners before I die. Maybe I can one-shot them. Yo, sledgehammer one-shots listeners. Good, I'm gonna buy that when I'm back alive because I just got mortared again. But it's not the gun. We need something that makes super loud sound. You know what? I'm getting a katana. Katana is worse, Sonny, I'm telling you. Fine, I'll buy the sledge. Okay, it doesn't one-shot a listener. I can confirm. Well, I just bought everything I could get to upgrade myself. It's time to kill kill some listeners! Oh, it's got AOE melon! I can hit multiples at once! Bro, I just destroyed an army of them! But then they still overwhelmed me. Yep, that's how she goes. This listener might overwhelm me. me die! I'm dead. Melon, I'm not gonna cap. If we team up with the sledgehammers, we could kill an army of them. Think so, Sonny? Yeah, where are you? I wanna see this. I'm fighting an army off right now as we speak. Then I'll battle my own army! Get over here! Oh my goodness, there's so many. There's like 30 of them! Die! Oh my goodness, I actually killed them all! I told you the sledgehammer has AoE, it's nuts! I'm wrecking them. I'm taking out every listener of the night. I'm trying to find you, Melon, I wanna help! And then three more came and killed me. Yeah, it do be like that. I slayed an army, but then another army came in its place. Yeah, you won the battle, but not the war. I'm trying to save this noob, but this listener won't go away from them. Bro, it wants to kill them so badly. I just found a katana laying on the floor. There we go, I saved the noob. Now, Melon, where are you? We gotta team up. I don't know. I'm just in the city area, Sonny. Oh, I'm fighting my own army. Time to win the war. Oh, we did. We absolutely crushed. Oh, Sonny, I found another army. I gotta take out real quick. Die! 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 Oh my goodness, I killed like 30 of them. No, I was so slow because my health was low. And then I got headbutted. I'm sorry, Sonny. I'm dead. Melon, we need to team up and test out these hammers. I know. I don't know where you are, though. I think we could find 
finally see each other. It's daytime. There you are. We're right next to each other the whole time. And now, Merlin, let's go. I'm gonna check out the hospital, Sonny. Let's see. I am searching for the Skiatsky still. Didn't find a gun, but I got more peaches. No gun in the hospital, Sonny. Yeah, it is insanely rare to find this thing. I found it the last two times I played. Well, aren't you lucky? Let me just kill this guy, and then I want to check the house that's on the top of the hill. Hey, I found an apple. I've never seen that before. Yep, I just grabbed an apple as well. Bro, why are these listeners trying to jump scare me? Dead. Killed him. Oh, no, I think there's gonna be more. I might have made a mistake. Please tell me the house on the hill has some good loot. Just peaches, Melon. Peaches, dang it. I'm finding a bunch of katanas, but no gun. Are you sure there's even a gun in this game? Yes, I'm sure, Sonny. I've seen it before. Well, I just found my first katana. Congratulations, Sonny. How do you drop items? Backspace. And now I have a sword of a thousand truths, and I will slice through my enemies. Melon, I found a weird house in the middle of the woods. Maybe this is where the gun is kept. I really hope so, Sonny. I'm going in. Moment of truth. Please, reveal yourself to us. We need you to become the heroes that this city deserves. Well, Melon, it's just an empty bed. There's nothing here. Dang it, bro. This is ridiculous. Melon, at the very least, we need to unite forces and sledgehammer all of our enemies. Where are you, Sonny? I don't know how to explain it. It's now dark and I'm on the edge of town. Go to the big cross. Go to the big cross. Okay, I'll head there in a second. Gotta investigate this house. No, Melon, can you go there now? Dude, I'm like two feet away from the house. Relax. I can't relax. There's like 25 listeners trying to kill me. Fine. I'll take them out myself. I don't even need you. Yes, honey. I am going to have that predicament myself. They're surrounding me. Come to the giant cross. I'm under it. I'm trying, Sonny. But they keep swarming me. I'm dead. No, there's too many. I need to pop my bandages. Okay, Melon, let's go to the cross for real this time. Okay. I'm going to try and find you, Sonny. But I can't even see the big cross. Neither can I right now. So maybe we're nearby each other. I'm fighting off an army as we speak. Are you in the streets or in a building? I'm in the streets. They keep pushing on me. I'm trying to find you, Melon. I'm near the big cross. I can't see the big cross. I can't see anything. If you're on the streets, just look up. I am looking up. Oh, there it is. I found the big cross. I'm going towards it. Okay, I'm climbing out of the sewers. I'll see you there. Melon, I'm directly under it. Oh, no. I got targeted by a listener, Sonny. I'm gonna try and make it there, but there's probably gonna be an army chasing me now. The timing's perfect! I just slaughtered some listeners. Now, Melon, it's time to hold our ground! Take them out! Yes. Are there any lanterns nearby? There is. Melon, I'm gonna plop this in the street so we can see better. Help me, Sonny! I'm dead. Oh, me too. Melon, I thought it would be a good idea to light up our world a little bit. It wasn't the best idea. Well, it turns out the listeners are an unstoppable force. I just got one-shotted. How many listeners were in that stack? Like, 20? Bruh. I'm telling you, Sonny, at night, the listeners are lethal. Melon, I'm convinced this whole gun idea isn't real. It's real. I'm telling you, I've used it multiple times before. I guess it's just extremely rare. Hey, Melon, you know what else is extremely rare? The Sunny Plushie on SunnyandMelon.com. Dang right. Go buy your big plushie now before they're all sold out. And if you're new around here, consider pressing the subscribe button for more videos. I got in trouble at Roblox school and sent to detention. All because I called Mr. Pig a bacon hair. Which made sense because he's literally a pig. But it turns out he doesn't appreciate getting cooked. So now I need to escape from school without getting caught. There's a lot of secret endings to this game. Comment if I should try and unlock them all. And can you support our channel by pressing the like button? It really helps new viewers find our videos. Thank you and let's get goaded. This isn't good, goats. I have to escape from Mr. Pig's detention. Why is he so weird? He's literally chowing... He was chowing down and then he farted in my face. Are you for real, bro? You were eating this slop right here too? Whatever. Let's just figure out how to escape this place. I'll speak to some fellow students. I'm too tired from the schoolwork. Yeah, what about these two back here? Let's get out of here. I agree, Sophia. We got a dip. No more schoolwork. That's true. Let's go. What about you over here? What you got to say? What got you in detention? I hope we don't get caught. Who knows what Mr. Porker would do? Our teacher's name is Mr. Porker. Porker? Bruh. I wonder if he realizes his name is Pork. Shouldn't it just be Pig? Pork implies that he got caught and eaten. Ew. I hear him farting in his own private bathroom. That is gross, man. I'm out of here. I'm just gonna follow the red arrow. 
ankles and dip. Bro, his pants are still at his ankles. He didn't even pull them up yet. Bro, you are smelly. Go away. Just gotta find my way out of here. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be totally fine. Just follow these red arrows. We're good. We're being chilling. Wait, I can click on these and get level ups? Oh, wait, no. I was imagining it. What the heck? This guy is after me. It's like run from the beast. Except it's run from Mr. Feast. Because he probably ate way too many feastables. Oh, Mr. Porker, what happened? That's what you get when you eat too many chocolates. Now, where should I go? Nah, I don't need a morph. I just want to escape this place and go home. But this obby looks crazy. I've got to run laps or something? Oh, no. Mr. Porker has a gym uniform, too. This isn't good. Let's see what the other students have to say. So tired. Hey, at least Cole made it out of the detention room. But now he's falling asleep in gym class. Bro, you gotta wake up. Let me eat this hamburger. Yo, I can actually mess with this stuff? And I found a secret. I can view a journal. No way. Secret journal. Mr. Fast Food. The big old burger. That's it? That's all it does? Okay. Well, I think it's time for me to leave. I'm gonna follow these green dots. Time to press this button and get out of here. Disabled the defense. And I'm not doing no math or counting. Oh, no. That was so cursed. Wait, why is he behind me now? What is this? Don't touch his pencils. Just get on the run. Follow the arrows. Don't touch the letters. They're deadly. I'm not spelling right now. I'm getting away from you, Mr. Pig. And then this should close off on him. Yeah, that's right. Squeal, pig, squeal. Yeah, he, for a big boy, has a very high-pitched voice. Anyways, I wonder what the twins have to say. The very best. But what do you make the best? I'm confused. Is this a cooking class? What are you making? I need to find a key to get to the teacher's office. Now, if there was a key, where would it be? Not here with the pizza, I'll tell you that much. Maybe if I press this button? Nice! It disabled another security system. Do I want to follow the yellow or the red arrow? The red arrows have been everywhere else, but I'm tempted to see what the yellow arrow does. Unlock B ending first. Oh, I have to go this way. Then I can discover the secret ending. That's pretty cool. I'll stick with the red arrows for now, though. Path A. Let's go. Gotta find a way to disable this with this button. Let's go? It disabled these lasers. I guess the button all the way over here might disable this one. Let's find out. What the heck's he doing here? Why is he a werewolf now? Oh, this is bad. I got a juke. Don't get caught. That was close. Path D. I got to unlock ending B. There's so many different endings to this game. Yes, I disarmed it in the back. Then I got to time it, time it, time it. Move to the other wall and get out of this place. I got this. Mr. Porker ain't catching me. Not even if he turns into a wolf. There's no way. And now I jump into the pit of doom. And let me guess, there's lava down here. I thought so. That's how you know it's a real lobby. If there's a bathroom and if there's lava. Just gotta get across this place and climb on up. I want to unlock all the endings to this game now. It's so cool. For now, though, it's super speed. Let's cook. Oh, not too bad. Mr. Piggy, I see you over there. What are you gonna do? Try and jump scare me? I don't think so. I'll hop across the rulers and the paper airplanes, and it won't be long until I'm out of this place. There's no way I'll let you trap me in school forever. Although he is humongous. He, he could probably eat me. I'm not gonna cap. He could definitely eat me. Me. Just gotta make these jumps peacefully, though. Get across all of these shapes. None of those wedges are gonna kill me. But I will keep on yapping as I flap my arms and legs to victory. We're jumping down! And what's in here? Oh, no. Kind of low-key looks like a barbecue. Mr. Porker, are you sure you want this down here? You're literally gonna get turned into bacon. And then I'll eat you. The tables will turn. Hop across the flames. And, hey, what up? Oh, he is just a shadow. He's kind of creepy, though. Climb up this ladder. And we're on level 20 already. I feel like we've almost escaped this place. We're getting close now. What's my friend gotta say? Cole, what's happening? I just called my big brother Blaze. He's a cop. I hope he gets here soon. Yeah, me too, bro. He could cook up the pork pig. And what's this? Zoe, is that really me? Or is it someone else? Hold on, let me check this. She's smiling there with big eyes and smiling here. It's... Wait a second, it's not a reflection. I can't see myself in the wall. This is cursed. This is cursed. I'm out of here. Gotta leave, gotta leave, gotta leave. I'm gonna talk to this girl, though. What's she saying? I can't believe it. We're so close. I hope so. I'm almost out of here, aren't I? Ryan, I'm guessing you tried to escape and failed. This isn't your first time in detention, is it, Ryan? Yikes. Whatever, just dodge the books. Don't want to get smacked by them. And hop. And time it. And hop. Ooh, what now? Boss fight. I gotta wreck him. Wait, I don't have any items to hit him with. All I have is a flashlight? What am I gonna do with this? Speed boost! I can't get through here. This is bad. What am I supposed to do to this guy? He's just snorting everywhere. He's like... <laughs> 
Oh, there's a countdown here. It says, hang in. Help is on its way. Just five seconds left until I get back up. I hope it's Cole's big brother, Blaze. And then he lights Mr. Porker on fire. Yo, I just escaped with a teleporter? Bro, what? I'm so sorry. The pig's crying. We did it. We stopped Mr. Pig and escaped. Dang right we did. We really did it, didn't we? Yeah, we did. I'm just worried about those creepy clones we saw in the mirror. Wait a second. They forgot they have this. It's the principal's key. No way. I have to log back in. Oh no. What is happening? Why is he getting more cursed? Oh, this is creepy. As it echoes through the darkness, the little one runs into the infinite seeking. Yeah, I'm not gonna cap. I am seeking seeking an alternate ending. So I shall use the key and discover the next secret in this game. This is cool. Ending A. That's right. We got the first ending and now I'm going back for ending B. Bro, the school bell is cooked. It just sent me back right away. I didn't even have to load in. Main mission, path B unlocked. Follow the white arrows and find path B. Yes, I will. I will find the new ending. No matter what. As long as I don't end up like her, I'll be fine. Mr. Pig literally turned Turned her into a puppet. And he's disgusting, by the way. You can still see and smell his farts. Yikes. And he thinks he can catch me. Not even close, buddy. I will find this secret ending if it is the last thing I do. And it very well might be, actually. I'm not capping. Jump over all the falling bookshelves. We're bing chilling. Oh, almost got flattened now, didn't I? But I didn't. And Mr. Pig is stuck. And it's time for me to get to the next ending. And look over here, guys. Outside the gymnasium, it looks like there's another secret ending ending. What is this one called? It doesn't have any labels on it. I think I could do this right now. Tap to change the shape. Find the right order to open the door. Oh, nice. Let's see. What would be the right order? There's got to be a clue around here. Do I just match them all up? No, that's not it. There has to be a clue around here somewhere. What's the order? Maybe this guy knows? Let's ask. Why can't I stop smiling? Zoe, you are creepy. Low key, you are creepy. Anyways, what's this? Blue is one. Green's two. Why can't I make this? I got to figure out what's over here. Nothing? That's it? What's the secret combination then? There's gotta be a clue for this. Huh. I am certainly confused. Are there shapes out here that I'm not seeing? <gasps> secret! Let's go! Secret base. Found something cool back here. I just don't know how to get inside of it. I wanna crack the shape code though. I can turn the water on. Can I open this fridge? No. I can move it though. What the? Bruh. There's a lot more to this game than meets the eye. Oh! I found a clue! Two is the star! Derp. Easy. I bet you all along the track is where the clues are. And I just need one more clue anyways. Then I can just guess the last combination. Come on. Where's the next clue? It's got to be around here. Paper airplane. No, I don't want this. Hey, found it. Three is a circle. And then I can just cheese the last one. And I need to get the shed key for this. Bruh, I'm finding the secrets. Number three is a circle. And now we just alternate this until it works. And there we go. Number one is a square. And now I've acquired a secret disc. I'm not entirely sure what it is. It's epic music though, nonetheless. I just wish I found a key or something more important. There's a lot of things out here for me to unlock. See, another secret area, item, key, playground house key. How many endings are in this game? I think I should just stick to unlocking ending B. I can always come back to this game and find all the rest later. I'm doing one last mission though. What's behind the shed? Uh, nothing, but there's a very creepy noise inside. And there's one more area here. I've got to check it out. I'm sorry. There's too many secrets to pass up. Interesting. Just an old radio and a couch. Weird. Very suspicious. Well, I'm gonna go get ending B now. I've been messing around long enough. I think Mr. Pig has probably been wondering where I'm at. There he is. Oh, he's not gonna get me. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Dodged. Easy. And this is where I get to choose the alternate ending. Let's go. There it is. Path B, the principal's office. I'm going in. And then look, there's even more secrets. The teacher's office. But for now, let's check out the principal's. Dude, it is creepy down here. What is up with this place? Whoa, I'm changing the colors of this? Maybe I shouldn't mess with that. Dodged dodged. Let's go. Ending B. Where's it taking us? And what does Ryan have to say? We always get detention. It's not fair. I agree. It's quite annoying, actually. We didn't even do anything wrong. We just called him a pig because he's a pig. Jump. Get across this obby and get to the next secret ending. Oh, I almost got hit. That was close. I know, I know. Let's have some fun. Dang right, Riley. I am having fun. I'm in the vents. Everybody knows cool things happen in the vents. Oh, this is creepy. Why are there ghosts? What? 
are you doing, Riley? You are weird. Or is that Zoe? I don't know. But she's cursed. Oh, no. She's dead, too. Oh, yeah, she's dead. Yo, what is this game? That is the craziest secret ending. But it's not even the end. It's just a weird secret. Well, I'll dodge the big old basketballs. And I'll find the real ending. Super jump acquired. No way. I'm in another obby. Okay, I gotta make these jumps, though. Oh, no. Oh, no! I got cooked! That's my first L all game. Dang it. I thought I was gonna go flawless. I got a little carried away, I guess. Thought I could make this. How do I do this? I jump from here? I guess so. Then I go around the planks, over the tip top, and keep making these jumps. Oh, yeah. It's not too bad. Not too bad. Gym class can't hold me back. It can try, but it won't succeed. I'm too skilled and far too athletic. You may not know this, but I'm quite the athletic specimen. Look at the size of my muscles. I know. They're low-key blocking out the sun. Then I'll continue on my journey with these big muscles so that I can see the secret ending B. Hey! Super jumps back. I gotta make this, though. I gotta time it. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Jump. Let's do this. We're getting close. Make the jump. Yes, that was awesome. I'm going for it. Oh, no. How far back did it set me? Eh, not that bad. Not that bad. Could have been worse. Wait, there's a secret over here. What am I doing? I got to grab this CD. CD's nuts. <laughs> and then I'll make the jumps. We'll actually get out of here and find ending B. It's like this and like that. And like boomski, but a goomski. And we're through. Super speed acquired. Let's go. Come on. I don't want to slip up now. We're starting to make real nice progress. Oh, it's those creepy ghosts from last time. And why am I following them? That seems like a bad idea. Whatever. I'm totally not in an ominous hallway chasing down ghosts. Everything's fine. Everything is totally normal. What is that? I... Do not like this place. It's very weird. And I'm hearing piggy snorts. Why am I hearing Mr. Pig growling? I just need to get out of this place. I do not want to question it any longer. It's close now, the ending. I can taste it. I just got to witness this. What is this? Congratulations, you've reached a new level and unlocked Ryan Marv. Keep progressing to earn more rewards. Bro, what the heck is that ending? That was so cursed. I feel like I'm in Stranger Things. Bro, that, that was like a Sonic Shins tape type of ending. I don't know. I don't know if I can play this game anymore. It's too scary. Oh, no. There's more to the cutscene. Or am I just getting teleported? Yep, I'm back in class again. But I've unlocked two new pathways, C and D. So goats, if you want to see me check out these new endings here on Escape Mr. Pig, comment down below and give this video a like. If we reach over 5,000 likes, I'll check out path C and D to unlock the secret endings. Meet with teeth. Today, we're taking care of Charles the Steak. Plus, we're gonna even show you a top secret ending. It involves an extra special ingredient. Stick around to see all the endings. Sonny, where the heck did you take me? I took you to Charlie the Steak. And look at this little guy. He's kinda gross looking. Are those human teeth inside of his steak? Uh, I think they are, Sonny. <laughs> what is this? Yo, you just picked up Charlie. What can I do with this? Hmm. There's a little Charlie the steak right next to me. Melon, let's not get distracted. Instead, let's complete the tasks. It's just like those Revenge of the Pow games. We gotta lock Charles in the preparation room. You're absolutely right, Sonny. Put him over here. He's gonna get nicely seasoned and marinated. Are we cooking Charlie the steak? I have a feeling we are. Yo, season him up. I'll get the pepper. And I'll get the jump scare. Ah, why? <laughs> I had to do it at least once. Bro, yeah. you didn't, though. I'm seasoning him with the paprika. And I got that salt. How do I do this, Sonny? Just just drop it on him. Just drop it on him. Now we've got to grab the foods and put it in the blender. What the? This kind of feels mean, Sonny. I feel like we're about to cook Charlie the steak and eat him. What if it's a plot twist and I'm going to push you inside of the blender? No. Don't do it, Sonny. Melons are not food. They're friends. Whatever. I'm going in the fridge and I'm going to put taco in there. Why are you putting a taco? Put like the fruits, the veggies. We got to put all of it. There's no choice. This is so strange. This is going to be a weird mix to put on Charles. Yep, it sure will be. The world's finest marinade. Bananas, apples, tacos, and cakes. And pizza. And hold up, another piece of meat. And a turkey leg. Oh yeah, that's a nice marinade right there. Now let's blend. 
Ew. <sighs> that looks gross, bruh. What the heck? I'll bring the mixing bowl, or you will, I guess. And boom! Well, Sonny, we have the marinade of this green toxic looking goop. I don't really know if you want to eat Charles after this. It's okay. You're giving him some nice flavoring. Yo, Charles did not like that. I'm gonna unlock him. Well, now we have to put him in the freezer, Sonny. I feel really bad for Charles, dude. Look what we did to this guy. Yeah, if he turns evil on us, let's not be surprised. And the freezer room is right here. Get in the freezer. Open up that door. Here we go. And now we've got to wait for Charles to freeze? But wait a second. The sign says sorry out of order. Maybe Charles is going to mutate. Melon, back up. Yeah, I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, no. He froze Oh, perfectly normally. Yeah, that's fine, actually. I got the hammer. I got to pound Charles with this hammer until he's nicely marinated. Yo. <laughs> Why did I freeze him just to unfreeze him? Because you needed the marinade to really soak in. Now we gotta cook him on the stove. I feel like whoever made this game has never made a steak before. Yeah, but they're full of mistakes, because this is gonna be disgusting. Yeah, it definitely will be. At least Charles is still smiling. He looks a bit burnt. Well, we've cooked Charles, and now we gotta put him in a trap. Over here, Melon. Put him in the cage. All right, I'm sorry for everything we've done to you, Charles. It was pretty messed up. Enjoy the cage. And now we're gonna leave you here forever. See ya! Yeah, we did all that, and we didn't even eat him. We're preparing him for something else the next night do you think a random monster is gonna show up and eat him i really hope i'm that random monster oh i'm hungry right now yeah but melon you marinated him with the most disgusting sauce ever besides we gotta find charles around the basement melon he's not in the trap he broke out of there why are there cockroaches everywhere and why can i pick them up i'm gonna put him in a blender oh wait i found charles wait He's back to normal. And he's got to eat all the roaches. Oh, I'm sorry I have to do this, Charles. Bro, this is so weird. Why are we feeding him cockroaches now? We're torturing Charles for no reason. What if he likes this? I think he's getting bigger. Yeah, maybe this is how you feed the Charles. And we were just, you know, massaging him earlier. Yes, we were making him very zen, very relaxed. Here you go, Charles. Well done. We've turned him green again. And now we're putting him on a dartboard. Okay, this is messy up. I don't like this. No, it's just acupuncture. Charles needs to relax. All right. Well, we can help him with this. It's called a deep tissue massage, Sonny. Yeah, it's something. I don't think it's healthy, though. Poor Charles. He's been taking a lot of heat recently. We'll cool him off with some planks. Correct, Amungo. Now what? Did we get the planks? Uh, Charles broke out of his dartboard, Sonny. Oh, no! It's fine. We just have to locate his position and get him to the next torturing device. I think I found out where he went. Sonny? Yeah? Charles is reading a sign that says destroy humans, destroy humans, destroy humans, destroy... Charles, no! Why would you do this to us? We were so nice to you. Melon, what's going on? I think Charles is taking his revenge on us. He's huge! We gotta find tools around to throw at Charles. Tools, 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 TNT. Melon, please help me. I'm dead. Melon, please. He whacked me and he threw me in a freezer. Yeah, same here. There were no tools. I just threw a hammer at him. Oh, find tools. Okay, find the tools. Come on. TNT. Glass bottle. Yeah, take that. TNT, I can't grab it. No. And now I'm being seasoned. Dang it. Bro, this game is so cursed. First, we were seasoning our steaks and now it's taking its revenge on us. No, where are the tools? That's the best I could do is hit him with a bottle. Uh, same here, Sonny. But it worked. No way. It knocked you him out. Him over. Let's go. We got to escape this place. Okay, we can escape through the basement door, Sonny. Up here, up here, up the stairs, up the stairs. Oh no, it's locked. And there he is. No, Charles, why? There's still more. Don't worry. Turn the blender upside down without getting caught by Charles. Oh, we got this. Charles is slow, brother. I'll distract him. All right, I flipped it upside down, Sonny. Yeah, I got Charles under control. Now I'm gonna take the sauce and add it to the blender without being caught by Charles. Well played. Charles kind of looks like a potato. I'm not gonna lie. The heck is Charles? is eating the blender. Then just press the button and blend him. Did we blend Charles up? I think we did. And now we can escape for real this time. Let's go. We got Charles twice. But I got a feeling he's not done yet. Survive ending? You managed to escape from Charles, but will he come back? We did it, Sonny. We got the good ending. Now let's try again for the evil ending. Oh, Melon, are you creating that nice marinade for Charles? Oh, yes I am, Sonny. While you add the food, I will put a secret in ingredient. <laughs> Check it out, Melon. What is that? It's a potion that I found over here. I'm gonna add it to our concoction. Whoa. What do you think it's gonna do to Charles? Nothing.
nothing good, that's for sure. This is what he gets for trying to eat us. Yeah, I don't know why he would do that. They were so nice to him. Yeah, it's not like we season him and put marinades on him and freeze him and hammer him. We're quite nice friends. We just play with him and hang out. You might call it that, Sonny. I think we gave him a shower, gave him a massage, gave him some acupuncture. Uh... And cryotherapy, which everyone knows is great for recovery. Exactly. Now let's blend. Ooh. Does that look a little more green than before, Melon? Perhaps glowing? Honestly, Sonny, I can't really tell. Dude, this is clearly glowing. The last one was just green and mushy. Well, you can apply it to Charles, then. I sure will. Hello, Charles. I have you a nice marinade. <laughs> he looks radioactive now. Yeah, what do we do with Charles? Just put him in the freezer again? I guess so. Now what's gonna happen? We wait for him to freeze. Melon, I think this time he's actually gonna mutate. You think so? Well, Melon, all that's left to do is hammer old Charles. All right. Now, what do we do with this radioactive Charles? Oh, yes, we must cook him. Exacto mungo. It's up to us to follow the instructions, Melon. And I bet you later on, something's gonna go a bit sussy. You think so, Sonny? I know so. Perhaps I should put a little TNT on him. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. I don't want to eat my steak with explosions. That's fine. Just pick him up and continue. Although it might make the flavor quite explosive in my mouth. Melon, you're weird. Just put him in the trap. All right, fine. And now we're out. Out of here. We leave and get to night two. There you are, Mr. Charles. Sonny, feed him the roaches. Oh, you like that, Charles? Oh, those bugs are sure are good, aren't they? Yeah, Melon, feed him roaches and I'll feed him dynamite. Now, where is it? Where's the dynamite? I could feed him hot sauce. Yo, give him that. Just put everything on him. Oh, he won't eat the hot sauce, Sonny. Maybe we could get him more radioactive waste if we get another bowl. But I don't think we have another bowl. And we need to put Charles in the highlighted dartboard and give him acupuncture. And he's definitely a lot more green than the last time. Yeah, Melon, this is not gonna end well for us. I got a bad feeling about Charles. Uh, maybe it'll make Charles a good steak and he'll like humans. I very much doubt that. Melon? Melon, the music's all ominous now. This is the point where Charles breaks out of the blender room. All right, everything looks the same, Sonny. Oh! Melon, it's not the same! His eyes are glowing! Oh, no. Take this metal hammer. Yeah! Uh... Come on, anything else? Ow, he's tossed me in the freezer again. Yeah, Sonny, your mutant Charles might be too strong. Why did we feed him that juice? Just try and hit him with TNT this time. There's no TNT anywhere. Yes, there is. I've got it. But every time I try and grab it, I can't pick it up. Because you can't pick it up, you silly Billy. Hit him with the glass bottle. You got it. Smacked him. Oh, no. But he is seasoning us. What do I do? What do I do? Melon, can you reach the potion? It's in the corner. No, I can't reach it. Dang it. At least we took him out. Looks like we have to escape. Melon, get out of here quick before he opens his eyes. I'm out. Sonny, this is the same thing as last time. Oh, no, it's not, Melon. It's far worse. Hit him with the hot sauce. It didn't work, Sonny. It looks like we're going to have to blend him once again. And this time, we have to apply the potion. Wait, you're right. Last time, I had to flip the blender, then add the ingredients. And this time, we're making a special. Special, special potion. Ah, uh, Melon, hurry! Melon, he's gonna get me! Melon, please! No, Sonny! How are you alive? I'm hiding behind the blender. It's keeping me alive. This is crazy. Hold on, maybe he'll turn around and face me. Ow, I'm dead! No! Don't worry, I'll revive myself. All right, not too bad. You did get Charles stuck behind the blender. Maybe that's a good thing? Dude, he's slowly levitating into the sky. We might get the glitched ending. Melon, Melon, I can't get down there. It's up to you now. Are you cereal right now, Sonny? Yes, I'm trapped back here. Okay, I'm adding the ketchup and now the mustard. And then that blender's ready. Press the button next to the blender. And blend, Charles! Wait, take the empty potion highlighted and add the liquid of the blender. Sonny, you're right. This is so much different than before. You're creating a mutant Charles. Or maybe it's gonna calm him down and make him nice again. Who knows? But I do know. I need to throw the potion on him! Oh no, Sonny went in the corner. It's okay. Just trick him to leave the room and go grab the potion again. I'm just gonna bait him around this thing right over here. And go, and go, and go! Melanie's on you. Get out of there quick. Actually, wait, he's coming over to me now. Hey -ya! Whoa. What's happening? You turned Charles pink! And now he's tiny again. Wait a second. It looks like we drained Charles's power. No way. And we can put him back in the trap. We saved the world. From an evil Charles. 
Get in there, and stay in there, Charles. And now we can escape this evil stake. <laughs> We've done it, Melon. We've saved the world from a tender ending. Let's go. We got the potion ending. Charles returned to his normal form, and everything went on as usual. Just like you goats should press that like button as usual, and head over to our store, SunnyMelon.com, to check out some epic merch, including our big new plushies. Yesterday, I enrolled in Jujutsu Kaisen Academy. But now, I need to get out of here. I mean, something is seriously wrong with Gojo. And that guy's OP. He could one-shot any of us. But before I can escape, I have to survive three nights. And on each night, things get freakier and freakier. Can I survive? Stick around to find out. All right, it's night one at Gojo's Academy. And so far, everything seems to be going fine. I just gotta collect some cursed orbs and stay away from the darkness. That shouldn't be too hard. Because I've got Gojo on my side. He's the strongest sorcerer of all time. Like, Broke could literally just hollow purple all of them. Anywho, I've gotta go and collect the orbs. What was that sound? Uh, didn't like that. It sounded like there was something coming from behind me. Well, I don't have time to be too concerned. I've got to collect all these orbs. And I think I see one over there. Just got to run over. Ah! No! What the heck? I knew I was supposed to stay out of the dark, but I died so fast there. Ugh, I guess I've got to sprint in between light sources. Well, at least I have two lives left. I just can't die. Why do I hear this thing chasing me? Anyways, I've got to go to this orb over here. Sprint, 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 sprint. Then I'm gonna make a run for it. This killed me last time, but now I've got full sprint. Come on, make it. Ah! Oh, he almost got me that time, but I did it. I survived, and I'm collecting the first orb. The green cursed orb. Now I've just got to run back to that other lantern. Uh-oh, I heard him chase me again. Oh, that was scary. Got to continue. Run between each part of the darkness and find the other orbs. Oh, that was a big sprint. That was a big sprint. Okay, we are chahilin. See another orb over there, I believe. Or no, that's probably just a light. Keep going this way. This game is huge. How am I supposed to collect every single cursed orb? I've got green and yellow. Oh, wait. I have a lantern that I could just hold out this whole time. I'm such an idiot. What the heck? What the heck? I have a lantern out and he still kills me. What is this game? I wasn't even in the dark. I was holding my own lantern. Oh, I've got to collect all the orbs again. I'll start with the green one over here. You stay away. Green orb acquired. Got to run over here. Re-grab the orange orb. Hey, there's another orb right over here. Just got to run and grab it. it. Looks like it's the white orb. White orb acquired. I'm running to this lamp. I think I got this. Okay, that was sketchy. That that was a big run. I just gotta run over to this next lamp. Oh, I might die here. Oh, no. No! No, no, no. Oh, I just barely made it. That was way too close. It looks like there's another orb over here. Oh, my good golly. Gotta start playing this more safe. I can't take huge risks like that anymore. I've got too many orbs in my hand. And I've only got one life left. Let's deposit these orbs. It looks like we're almost back at the home base. I'm back here. Place this orb. The green orb. The white orb. The brown orb. And now all we're missing is the purple orb. I have a feeling it's over to the left somewhere. I didn't really explore that area too much. Okay. Oh, there it is. The purple orb's over there. I've just got to make a big sprint. I think this is the closest light. And run! Oh my goodness, this one's far. Oh, I hate doing far ones like that. Now I've got it. It actually wasn't purple. It was technically pink. Now I've got to sprint back. Finally, I made it back. It's time to place down this final orb. I can't believe this was all just night one. Congratulations, everyone. You have passed night one. Get ready and prepare for night two. I lost two of my lives on night one. How am I supposed to get past two more nights with only one life? This is going to be tough. Mmm. Where is Gojo? Wait, you're telling me the Gojo I saw isn't the real Gojo? Oh no, we've got to get out of here. We've got to escape Gojo. He's being freaky. Where's the emergency door? I have a feeling it's in this painting. Oh, no, it might be over here. Here it is, the emergency door. No, Gojo, Gojo. Oh no, I gotta get out of here. Okay, I can't look back. I can't afford to, okay, I gotta look back. Ah, I gotta keep going. I've gotta keep going. Open the door. Oh no, there's more stuff. Are you kidding me? Uh, uh, Oh, why is everything collapsing? Oh no, Gojo's moving quick, yo! Dodge, Bob, weave. I can't afford to look back anymore. I'm just gotta keep dodging, bobbing, and weaving. Come on, come on. What the heck is happening? All right, everything's fine. Everything's fine. What is this? Click multiple times to open? Oh no, oh no, oh no. 25? Where is he? Come on, click 50. 50! Okay, I made it out of there. Oh, that was terrifying. I have a feeling Gojo is right behind me. Yeah, you're right. We have to stop Gojo. This is getting insane here. I have to charge three talisman above 80% of its energy, and I have to finish this before 6 a.m. Wait, is this like my weird strict dad now? What is going on? I can regain cursed energy by absorbing, but beware that Gojo might appear anytime. Oh, this is not good. The only place that's safe from Gojo is inside the cursed barrier. All right, I need to charge all talisman. Uh, wait, is that Gojo right there? 
Oh, that freaked me out, man. Okay, here's what we got to do. We've got to gain the cursed energy from right here. Yo, is that Sakuna's eyes? And we've absorbed our cursed energy. Now, what we need to do is go and fill up every single talisman. I've got to beware. Gojo's around here. Let's fill up this talisman. Oh, I got to spam it. Oh, what? That was only 20? Oh, this is going to take a while. I've only gone until 6 a.m. How am I going to do this? I might have to do a little bit of pay to win. Mm, nah, none of these seem that good. I'll just do it all legitimately. Just sucks that I can only hold 20 cursed energy at a time. I'm gonna have to do this process a whole lot. I don't honestly know how I'm supposed to do this before 6 a.m. These hours better move in real time. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I gotta run back to the cursed barrier. Where's Gojo? Where's Gojo? I don't like this. I don't even have enough stamina. What is this? Bro, that's impossible. You literally cannot win. What the heck? Can I revive myself? Oh, I can. Let's go. Pay to win. That'll let me beat the game. Now I gotta run to the cursed barrier. Okay, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'm in the cursed barrier. Oh my goodness, that was so silly. Dude, it's only at 77. I filled up on cursed energy four times now. And I've got three more. Dude, this is, I don't even think you can beat this. I genuinely don't think you can beat this. Unless there's only two talisman. But the Medan will try. This one get filled up at all? Nope. Gotta charge this as well. This one at least is going a lot quicker. It's already at 40. I gotta get to the Gojo barrier. Come on. You better not appear in front of me. Gojo. Gojo. Okay, I made it. That was cursed, dude. I think I'm gonna have to get this. Oh my goodness, I almost ran out of sanity. Okay. Well, I'm gonna buy the Sakuna's finger just in case. Oh, never mind. I can't buy it. Scratch that idea. We're about to finish our first talisman. Probably not, though, because it's weirdly bugged. Yep, 97 out of 100. Why would it do that? Don't understand. Can I please sprint? Thank you. All right, let's fill up the first talisman. Boom, 100%. Let's go. The other one over there is at, like, 78. So I guess we could finish that, too. Let me charge up on my cursed energy. I wonder if I can go over the top for my cursed. That would actually be clutch. It might allow me to win. All right, fill this bad boy up. It's at 92. All right, and I have a feeling Gojo's gonna spawn in in a moment here and kill me. Please let me, yep, there he goes. I'm gonna die here, I'm gonna die. Come on, come on, get to the barrier. Oh, just before Gojo spawned in, that was close. Gojo, I don't think Gojo sees me. I think he has a certain running path. Dude, it's 4 a.m. This is getting really close here. Charge up on my cursed energy, and then we'll just have one more talisman to go. Here it is, and now it's fully charged, let's go. Just one more, one freaking more talisman. This is the hardest one. This one is by far the furthest away. But I should be able to get this done before 6 a.m. It's gonna be close, though. All right. We filled her up to what should be 30. There we go. We can just fill it up one more time before Gojo spawns in again. We should look good before hour 6. No. This is not good. This is really bad timing. Really, really bad timing. Hold on. Hopefully Gojo runs the other way. He just did a lap around the school, which means I should be able to get to the barrier without him killing me. Okay, we made it safe. This is gonna be tough to fill up the last talisman before 6 a.m. This is cutting it close here. I've gotta sprint there as quickly as possible. Okay, fill that up to 50. Oh, dang it. It only filled up to 48, but that's fine. That's fine. We should be able to get this in the next three. And for some reason, stamina doesn't matter. I don't know why I've been stopping. <laughs> like, my stamina drains, but I still sprint just as fast. Here, I'll show you. Check it out. I'm sprinting. I'm sprinting. I'm sprinting. Oh, no. My stamina's up, but I'm still running just as fast. Oh, I've been wasting so much time for no reason. Okay. Just one more left. One more left. We've got this. This is gonna be really, really close here. Gojo could spawn in at any second. Sprint. Sprint, but we've gotta fill this up. We don't have a choice. We have to fill it up here. It's the only way. Please. Please let this end the game. Fill it up. Fill it up. It's filled, but I still gotta return to the barrier. Oh no, this isn't good. Gojo, don't turn that corner. Gojo, stay away! I've got to run to the barrier. I can't look back. I can't. No! No way I die like that. I refuse. I refuse. I'll revive myself. And then run back to the barrier. I won? That was the whole game? You got the good ending. You have successfully sealed Gojo, but he broke free from the seal. At least you managed to escape from Jujutsu High. I'll take it. I guess. I definitely cheated very hard.